Today I wanted to come out publicly and tell you guys what I just did. I have officially FOMO'd in big time to the Mystery Mary token. And I have a good reason for it. And now I've been watching this community grow and I've been saying how I feel like I missed it. I feel like I missed it. But I'm seeing the community rally around this coin. I'm seeing the excitement of a potential crypto.com exchange listing that everybody wants. That's pure speculation, guys. But there is reason for that speculation. We're going to go through that in this video, why I ended up buying the mystery token. And then later on, after buying the token, I came across a very speculative theory that I want to lay out for you guys that might be the actual road to the crypto.com exchange listing. The thing that makes the most sense to me of how and why crypto.com may possibly, pure speculation, list this mystery Mary token, one of the most trending memes on Kronos next to Crow with Knife and Stuck, which is actually number three right now, which is very interesting. But I want to talk to you guys about this. Welcome back to the Crypto Report, everybody. I am Crypto Kip. That's right, guys. I FOMO'd into the mystery Mary token, and it is for good reason, my friends. Now, I did buy into this coin right about... Right around here this morning, right at about you know five nine or six something like that, and uh, we're getting some upward movement. So already in the green on this and this purchase, which is beautiful to see. The reason I ended up buying this coin is because this coin was created by a community member that's been around for a while, and you know the Crow Fam Kronos community rallied around him. And if you go into the Discord, you'll see they're very active in the Discord. I've been watching this. I've been looking for an entry. I didn't quite get an entry. I could have taken an entry here and I should have, and I didn't. And you should buy red candles and take profit in green candles. But if there's an exchange listing coming, guys, then there could be more upside ahead, potentially for this token, which is why I decided to get in. Now, if you look at Crow with Knife, when it got listed on crypto.com, it actually had a massive explosion. Here was the move, guys. It went up 7X in four days. And since then, it has been selling off a little bit. People have just been taking profits. I've taken my share of profit as well. In fact, I shuffled a little more profit out of Crow with Knife today. I still have a beautiful allocation in Crow with Knife because, again, I more broadly, broadly speaking, believe that there could be a mega Kronos meme coin mania coming down the pipeline. I'm going to share a tweet with you guys in a little bit, actually, to talk more about that. Um, but, guys... We saw Crypto.com list Crow with Knife. It went up 7x in four days, an incredible move. And if Mary gets an exchange listing as well, it could see a similar move. Now, how did Crow with Knife get listed? Let's break this down for you guys real quick. Crow with Knife got listed for a couple reasons. One, the community was incredibly strong. Two, Kronos Chain realized how incredibly strong that token was, and then they decided to come out with the DIP token. And on the DIP token, when they launched this coin, they launched it in a very interesting way. VVS Finance themselves, the number one DEX on Kronos, actually did a pre-sale for this token where they were accepting Crow with Knife tokens as a donation. And when they took this donation of Crow with Knife tokens for the pre-sale, they would give you your dip tokens uh, allocation for this launch of this coin uh, to speculate on this coin. But they guaranteed to take those Crow with Knife tokens and lock that liquidity for 12 months. Now, when I saw that happening and when I saw VVS going to grab the liquidity for the Crow with Knife token, a very exciting meme coin that was happening in the Kronos ecosystem, it led me to believe, and I predicted this even, that they were going to potentially list this on crypto.com because by acquiring the supply of the Crow with Knife token and grabbing that liquidity, the Kronos Labs team and the crypto.com team could have more assurance that that token would not be a rug pull. By owning the liquidity and locking it for 12 months, that prevents that rug pull movement. That doesn't mean that sellers can't come along. Clearly, we've seen that Crow with Knife, obviously, right now, has some sellers. There's a sell-off happening right now on this token, and that's why we have some downward pressure. But a rug pull is when you have one giant red candle or two giant red candles in a row, and it just goes to zero, and the liquidity gets pulled. But again, it's locked liquidity. So the market cap for Crow with Knife is $51 million. 
And the market cap for the mystery token, Mary Coin, is $27 million. Now, that's a pretty good market cap, guys. And there's already a partially locked liquidity of a little over $1.5 million or so, it looks like, which is pretty decent. So here's the theory. Okay, my friends, how does this thing get listed? Well, my theory is that Crypto.com and the Kronos team have to have more assurance that it's not going to get rugged. Now, I don't think that the leader of this community or the community has any intentions of doing a rug. I've just been following it. It's a very large market cap coin. There's already a lot of liquidity. I don't think this can rug at this point. I think the days of mystery token having an opportunity to get rugged are long gone and they, they probably disappeared somewhere around these giant green candles over here as this liquidity started to get locked up. But here's the theory, and this is pure speculation. VVS Finance just came out and they are promoting a new pre-sale. They're doing an initial meme offering, a brand new one, the Moon Token. Now, I don't know if this is a play off of like Matt Damon, uh, if they're making fun of Matt Damon here, embrace the movement, you know, and commit. Fortune favors the brave. I think they're maybe making fun of Matt Damon in the Crypto.com ad, which is kind of funny, you know, kind of fun. You've seen that with Bowdoin and some of these other meme coins across the crypto space. But this meme coin offering that VVS is putting out is this, this is the only meme coin offering they've put out that comes out on May 15th since the, let's just look at it together. Here's this meme offering. Do you see a meme offering? No meme offerings, couple votes. Where's the last meme offering? If you just scroll down, you will see where's the last meme offering and you will eventually see that the last meme offering was by the dip token. They have not done a pre-sale since the buy the dip token on their platform. And so let's let's go back again. What was the buy the dip token that they launched on their platform designed for? It was designed to get liquidity for the Kronos Labs team of Crow with Knife tokens so they could lock that liquidity for 12 months. And here's the theory. The odds of, of, of Mary Mystery Token getting listed on Crypto.com, in my mind, just went way up, but it's too early to tell if this is what they're doing. But the theory that I have is this. VVS Finance and the Kronos Labs team might be doing a liquidity grab for the Mary Token. And if this presale, if, here's the hypothesis, if this presale is allowed to have a contribution of Mary Mystery Tokens, and the Mystery Token team gives those Mystery Tokens to this presale, then there is a very, very strong chance that that is the move to get Crypto.com to list the Mystery Mary Token. And if that happens, my friends, then we might see a lot more upside for this Mystery Mary Token. Now, that is one of the reasons that I bought this coin, but admittedly, I didn't even know about this moon token until I bought Mary. So I do have some bias at this point because I am now a holder of the Mary token. I'm not affiliated with them in any way. I'm not an ambassador for the Mary token. I'm not an ambassador for this moon token. I don't even know if I'm going to buy this pre-sale. But I wanted to lay out this theory. I wanted to tell you guys why I bought Mystery. Why did I buy Mystery? Because the community is huge. It's very strong. Great liquidity. Big market cap. So much excitement in the space. I just can't sit on the sidelines with this anymore. I FOMO'd in. I don't like to FOMO into place. But I'm being honest with you guys. I'm telling you what I did here. I've got a lot of profit to play with from Crow with Knife and some of the other plays. And so I'm getting involved in a token which I think the Crow, Crow fam is rallying around. And with this move, I'm curious, guys. Let me know in the comments down below. Do you think that I'm right here? Do you think that VVS has a chance of doing another presale where they take these mystery tokens as a donation to access this presale and then they take that locked liquidity and do something insane by grabbing that liquidity and then feeling comfortable to listen on crypto.com or am I off here? All a theory, guys. Pure speculation. You know I have some bias on this now because I'm holding bags of this coin. It's already a big market cap, but... I'm watching the Crow fam. I'm seeing what's going on. And I also want to share this with you guys really, really quick. I've been following a lot of people on social media to just see what's going on in the space. And there's been a lot of folks out there that have been talking about meme coins for quite a while, for a very long time. And recently, this influencer right here, Jake Gagan, who's been very big in the Solana meme coins, who has, by the way, 
a lot of followers on Twitter. This guy's got 264K followers on Twitter and over 100,000 subscribers on YouTube. I, I believe about 100,000 subscribers on YouTube. Just said this today. Kronos will have a meme coin bull run of their own in 2024, similar to Soul and Base in 2024. The community is strong and it's incredibly easy to buy and sell meme coins in the Kronos chain, which is very true. And he's saying study Kronos and study crypto.com. There's a strong chance, guys, he's going to come out and start promoting crypto.com meme coins, buying these meme coins, talking about them more. And there's a strong chance, guys, that people, the masses, right, across crypto could start paying attention to Kronos and could start allocating some funds into the Kronos ecosystem. Guys, I actually just helped another friend of mine get into the Kronos DeFi ecosystem. There's clearly people paying attention. People are feeling they have the fear of missing out. I'm even guilty of it sometimes, but you got to be careful, guys. It is not safe to FOMO into coins. Now, I'm guilty of it today, but I do have a method to the madness. I have a strategy behind that. Now, I am not telling you guys to buy this token. I am not telling you guys that this thing is inevitably going to get listed and that it is going to go to the moon. I'm saying that I'm speculating. I'm investing into meme coins based on my research, based on my understanding of the Kronos ecosystem, which I've had my finger on the pulse now on for two years as we've been doing 3,200 videos across the last two years. Long video for you guys, but I bought the mystery token today. I'm excited about it. And this new theory, it's very interesting, guys. That's all I got in this one. I'm Crypto Kip. This is the Crypto Report. Don't forget to smash the like button, subscribe to the channel. As always, guys, don't forget to DCA HODL, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks, everybody. Have a great night. Two videos for you right here if you want to check them out. Peace, y'all. I'll see you next time.